Hello everyone, welcome to the second part of the Cloudways video. Today in this video, I'm going to show you a step-by-step -step process on how you can migrate your existing WordPress website to Cloudways. It's very, really, very simple to do this and the process is pretty straightforward. So even if you don't have much technical knowledge, you can follow along with me and migrate your website to Cloudways. So I have an existing WordPress website that is hosted on my own domain on blockingchain.in and this is how it looks like. It's a demo website that I've built for this particular tutorial. So what I'm going to do is in few simple steps, I'm going to migrate this website to Cloudways. And not just that, I will then show you how you can set up your own domain name on Cloudways. So in the previous uh, Cloudways video, we had hosted a WordPress website on Cloudways and this is how it looks like. So if you haven't watched that video, I would highly recommend you to first go and watch that video because we are going to migrate our WordPress website to this domain that was provided to us by Cloudways. So the link of it is given in the description box and also at the top. So give it a watch. So let's begin our migration process. So first we need to go to our WordPress dashboard that we have for our existing website. And here we are going to install a plugin. It's a free plugin that is provided by Cloudways to migrate the WordPress website to it. So let's type Cloudways here. And here you can see there is a plugin that we can install, which is called Cloudways WordPress Migrator. So let's install and activate this. So it is installed now. Now let's manage this plugin. Here we will have to fill in some uh, details that are required. So for migrating first, we need to put in our email here. So whatever email ID you want to use, you can use it here. Agree to the terms and condition and click on migrate. Okay, so in order to migrate our website, we need to put in some information that is required here. Let me zoom in a bit. So the first thing that we need to put in here is the destination site URL. So as I've told you previously that we are going to migrate our existing WordPress website to this domain that was provided by Cloudways. So we are going to put it here. The next is the SFTP host or server address. So this is the IP address that we need to put. So let's go back to our Cloudways dashboard and with an application, the application that was created from here, you can just copy this public IP, just click on it and it gets copied. So copy it here and next is the database name that we have to put in and the SFTP username and the SFTP password. Okay, for the database name, go back here and this is the DB name that is provided. I'll put it here, the SFTP username. So for getting the SFTP username, you need to go to your server that was set up. You might have uh, multiple servers, but whatever server you are going to use so to which you are going to migrate your website to, you will have to choose that one. And this is the username that I have copied and this is the password. Okay, so uh, there are some multiple uh, information that is required like HTTP auth enabled or not. So if the destination that we are going to migrate to, is it password protected? We are not sure of it yet. So let's click on no. And here are some multiple source site information. Uh, you can explore that. For now, we will keep the default one as no and click on migrate. So it is going to take some time to migrate this WordPress website to Cloudways and you will have to wait for some time. So here you can see that it is showing that your site is being migrated to Cloudways. This is the domain that we had initially and this is the one to which it is migrating to. So our migration process is completed and it was pretty fast. It just took about four to five minutes to do so. Now let's go to this WordPress uh, domain and see whether our changes are made or not. Let's reload this. Oh, that's cool. Our unblocking chain website is now hosted to this domain. Even if now I go to my unblocking chain.in, it should stay as it is since I have not removed this as of now. Now it's time to add our existing domain name to our migrated website. For that, let's go to our cloud-based dashboard and with an application, go to the application and here go to domain management. So you can see that this domain is set as primary, which we were using initially. Now let's add a new domain here and put in unblocking chain dot in and click on add domain. You need to take care that uh, once it is added, we need to make this one as primary. So let's make it primary, set as primary. So now this is set as primary, our unblocking chain dot in is set as our primary domain. Let's go back to the access details and 
copy this public IP. I will show you why I'm copying it here. So now we want to point our DNS settings to the new site that we have created so that it becomes live. For that, you will have to go to the website from which you have bought your uh, domain name. Uh, I have bought it from GoDaddy and go to its DNS settings. So here we just have to make a few edits. So let's edit this entry. So just click on uh, edit and here instead of this value just paste the IP address that you have copied from your uh, cloud-based dashboard and hit on save. Once it is saved and your DNS records are updated you should be able to see a live website so let's go to unblocking chain and hit on refresh. So congratulations, we have successfully migrated our WordPress website to Cloudways and not just that, we have also set up our own domain name. You can see how simple it was and it will definitely ensure faster page load times and much more benefits that comes with Cloudways. So that's all for this video. If you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to this channel for more such videos in future.